Hello, hello, and welcome back to Hitman Freelancer. And we continue on with our final syndicate of the campaign, The Wolf. And next up, I think we're going to go for the alerted territory of Berlin, where we have four targets, one safe and one supplier. Uh, we have perfect shooter, headshot kills only, and a silenced sniping rifle kill for our optional objectives. And uh, moving on to our prestige uh, objectives, we have epic assault rifle kill, silent assassin, and a collateral kill accident. Uh, as predicted, I will go for the collateral kill accident. It's probably the easiest at the present to achieve. So we're going to need tools and equipment. So first of all we're going to take our silence pistol from the weapon wall, make our way over to the tools crates or suitcases or briefcases whichever you want to call them and we're going to take our I believe tranquilizer gun, still don't have the seeker one at the moment. I think that will do, so we're going to make our way now off to Berlin. Safe journey, 47. Intel tells us that there are Syndicate members in the area. I trust that you can find them and eliminate them. However, this is no walk in the park. They are on high alert, so you need to be careful. You know what to do, 47. So here we are in Berlin, and let's hope we can do slightly better with our objectives than we did in the Isle of Scale. So I'm just going to grab that coin there, that might come in handy later. And we're going to move off, and the first thing I want to do is get myself a change of disguise. and. I'm heading over to the Blackers uh, hangout and up on the top floor here we will find one lone Blacker all on his onesies and we can just shoot him in the head. We're going to take his outfit and we're going to take his gun as well. Now we've already lost Perfect Shooter as an optional objective somehow. Don't know how. Uh, probably through taking out a camera somewhere along the lines. So we do still have our headshot kill and our prestige objective available. We also have the silenced sniping rifle kill and I think there's a sniping rifle somewhere around. But in the meantime, during my wonders, I have noticed that there is a safe at the juice bar. So what we're going to do now is run around and locate that safe, I believe it's around here somewhere. Let's see, ah, there it is, it's inside the juice bar. And there are no clues out here, so all of the clues must also be around at the rear here. So as we make our way in, ah, what do we have right here? We have a file folder so that is clue number one taken care of so there must be two more clues in this area somewhere it looks like there might be a laptop here there is so two down one more to go uh, there's a banana there that's so i don't see anything else in this area as such maybe there's something through the gate here Apart from a camera and two guards, luckily neither are enforcers. I can't s ah, there we are. And you was hiding, was you? So we have our third clue. So the safe is now unlocked. Now all we have to do is gain access to it. But we do have these three juice bar attendants to deal with. So I'm thinking, first of all, shall we shoot them all in the head? That could cause some panic and alarm would slow us down at the very least, possibly get us killed. So we're going to do this the old-fashioned way. 
So once the young lady finishes her cigarette and moves away, we can subdue her colleague from around the corner here. We're going to hide his body in the crate provided, or the dumpster. And then we're going to move on to take out the young lady. Now we're going to distract her with the generator over the far side of the courtyard. Now do be aware there is a, a biker enforcer just in the biker's hangout behind us. Uh, he will be around as part of his patrol. Just see him there. We need him out of the way. So we're going to turn on the generator and turn it off again. The young lady will go to investigate. The enforcer is moving away. So we can now render this young lady unconscious. Uh, we could drag her to the crate. But we do have a shipping container sitting right here. So we'll put her in here for the time being. Now, we have two of our victims out of the way, we preferred to go. Now, the easiest way would be to shoot him in the head, but that will attract attention. So, we're going to do this, again, the old-fashioned way, and we're going to drop our assault rifle, grab the juice attendant outfit, and dismiss the gentleman. You're elsewhere. Oh. So off he goes, that now gives us access to the safe and we can crack the safe open and that will get us one step closer to yet another challenge I believe and make us a little bit richer. So once we've done that we can go back and retrieve our biker's outfit, I'm going to leave the gun there, we don't need that really and we're going to move on now and see what else we can find. It turns out between us and our targets, we will encounter the supplier. So let's go and see what wares he has to offer for us today. Hey you, you need anything? I'm interested. And what the supplier has is not very much. Uh, we don't really have a, a lot of cash. I think I'm going to take the covert submachine gun. Uh, that might come in handy at some point. I don't think I have one of them. And we can pocket it. So see ya. that will do no for today. Thank you very much, sir. Pleasure doing business with you. Onwards to our four targets. Now we still have our headshot kills our sniping kill and our collateral kill yeah. objectives to complete. We do have four targets to attempt them with if we can locate the stairs. They're around here somewhere. Uh, no, I've just run past them, haven't I? Yep, there we go. So at least one of our targets is down here. Ah, there they are, closer than we thought. So target is moving away. Um, Remembering I don't have to worry about the cameras, a silent assassin rating is not required, which is lucky because I have killed a few people. So we're just going to follow this target. She's heading down into the bar area and just out of sight at this point there is, there you can see, a second target. They're both going to be in the same location at the same time. So we have an opportunity for a two for one deal and I'm going to just make my way into the area with my pistol and I am going to proceed to shoot both of them in the head. There goes one and where's the other one? There you are. There's a third target not far away. You targeted the wrong person mate. Right let's run away because I didn't realize there were guards all over the place as well. So we'll come back for that other target later. In the meantime, I'm going to go and hunt down the sniping rifle, which should be around here. And it looks like Agent Tremaine has packed up his sniping rifle and vacated Berlin. Possibly because we kept killing him. So there's no sniping rifle, so we can scrub the sniping rifle kill objective from our mission and that gives us two failures so we are still getting the headshot kills 
here is our next target and I have Command, deemed you, you to be our collateral kill uh, attempt. So we're just going to knock you out rather quickly. We have alerted the Hello, other guard at the bottom assistance? of the stairs. Uh, we do need a collateral for our collateral kill. So he will do nicely. We're just going to try and no take this guy down as quietly as we can we don't want to trigger any more alerts or alarms we don't want our victim being found and luckily for us you've decided to investigate this corner and you instantly regretted it did you not right so we're gonna put our collateral next to our target and we will now need to find a way to eliminate them both in an accident now, I happen to know there are propane cylinders available on this map. There is our last target, I believe. So, we need to find one of these propane cylinders. Now, there is one over in the biker's bar that I'm pretty sure I've seen on a previous playthrough of this level. I can't remember which campaign it was or which syndicate it was but we did come to Berlin and I did notice there was a propane cylinder here. There's usually two but we only need one. So with the propane cylinder in hand we can now return all the way across the map and drop our propane cylinder off. As you can see uh, as part of the alerts that we have caused due to leaving bodies everywhere uh, there are a number of guards up here so we're just going to quickly wipe them out and return to our target who has waited very very patiently for us along with his collateral colleague and we're just going to plant down the propane cylinder somewhere where it will eliminate them both, preferably somewhere between them both or near their heads. This looks good enough for me. We're going to move a safe distance, pull out our silence pistol and destroy the propane cylinder. It will surely be a blow to the syndicate. So that's three of our targets taken care of and more importantly our prestige objective obtained. So we're just going to now move, move on in on our final target and as long as we get a headshot kill for this we will gain ourselves a few extra coinage. So there is our target, we're just going to take aim and shoot them in the head and then immediately vacate the level. So down she goes. Excellent work, 47. You've spread fear within the syndicate. Return to the safe house. Collect yourself. I'll be in touch. So as mentioned, we're just going to make a beeline for the nearest available exit. And the nearest safe exit for me will be the push bike over at the beginning of the level here. So we're just going to hop on that and we're going to pedal our way all the way back to our safe house. So a relatively successful mission this one. Not ideal but we did get our um, collateral kill by accident objective achieved which is quite a nice tidy sum. So there we go, level 2 has been completed successfully and we have 4 more levels of this campaign to go. This is further than I have ever got in Let Freelancer. You're ready for your next assignment. So once we're back at the safe house we're just going to drop all of our gear straight onto the wall go managed to pick up ourselves some poison as well while we were out there those crates do come in handy here and there and our prize today will be a proximity taser concussion device or pneumatic syringe antique i'm gonna take the taser 
and we're gonna leave the story there for now we will pick up the syndicate again in the next episode i have been anubis and i will see you all in the next video